fellow Sudokans, and welcome to Zen and the Arts of the Guardians Sudoku Puzzle. It's uh, Thursday, the 3rd of August, 2023, evening time here in Bangkok. I'm feeling a bit sleepy, but I've got to stay awake because I've got some small amount of work coming in later that I have to stay awake for. So uh, you are my way of staying awake. I should be playing the game of Sudoku for you. What's going on in the world? I see Singapore has executed, uh, performed its third execution in a week. Uh, you know, it's resumed executions uh, and it's the fifth this year. Please don't, Singapore, please don't, all countries, please don't execute people. Do not, do not have state sanctioned murder uh, on your books, whatever country you are. It's really a, a terrible thing something that, and and in the case of singapore it's not even for the crime of murder which we always imagine is the most horrific it's for drug smuggling and don't you dare say it's a deterrent if it's a deterrent how comes you've done it five times this year if it's a deterrent you wouldn't have done it would you so that's an absolute nonsense so uh nasty nasty uh executions uh in whatever country they are being performed in u.s china singapore and other countries Please stop. Right. Uh, okay. We'll get on with the game of Sudoku. I can see something which is not the most obvious thing. Maybe but what I see is a New York Times style of thing. But oh, let me look at the clock. I've got to watch out because today's been really long Sudoku play <laughs> games. Uh, this one can't go on for too long. Let me see what the time is now. Uh, okay. So, okay. Right. I just got that in my head. Now I see the nine, two, and four blocking down here so we will have nine two and four in these squares and once we do that it means that this has to be one three and five so we got three and five here so that is going to be a one and we will have three and five here let's look up here what do we need we've got three and five down there so uh we're six seven and eight so we've got six and seven here so that is going to be an eight is it not i think so right okay i think that's correct um right Well, I'm not seeing anything else immediately. Oh, I have seen something now. I see the nine blocking down here and across here. So that means we have nines in those squares. Then we have four blocking across here and across here. So we do have a pair of nine and four here. What does it mean, nine and four? So the ones... Hmm. Well, the twos are here or here, and then over there. Uh, the six. S okay, seven. Uh, seven blocking down here, seven blocking. Uh, this has nothing to do with the <laughs> me finding that pair. It has nothing to do with it, but anyway. Uh, let's look back again. So this is nine and four. Now we have one, two and six one two and six are surrounding like that so we can't quite get those yet oh yes we can look two there two down there somehow i missed that somehow i didn't see that two as is often the case for me so then we have one and six in these squares so one blocking there there's our one there's <coughs> our six <coughs> Six blocking down here, down here, and across there. There's our six. <clears throat> two blocking down here and down here. That will give us a two in that square. Uh, missing from up here, we're, one of them's eight. So we see the eight blocking across. Let's put the eight in quickly, and then let's work out what the other missing number is. It's a five. We've also got five blocking down here, so five there. Uh, 
I what did I work out at the beginning? Something nine two and four down like this, didn't I? Work that out. So I said nine two and four are in those squares. So now we got five blocking there. That's going to be a five. And this is nine two and four. So this is a three. Okay. Uh, missing numbers across here are 3, 6, and 9. We've got 3 and 9 in this block, so that's going to be a 6. Um, we've got a pair of 6 and 7 here because we've got 6, 7 here, 6, 7 here, and 6, 7 here blocking up and across so that is a pair of six and seven so one blocking down here and across here will give us a one in that square five blocking this square means that that is our five we'll finish this row with an eight now eight blocks across here eight blocks up here and down there so there's our eight and we know this is what did I say seven and six and seven, sorry, six and seven here. Uh, yeah, that makes sense. That's six or seven up there, doesn't it? Six or seven. So this is three and nine. Any help on three or nine? I uh, don't think so. But we've got nine blocking this square. So in this column, that's the location of nine. This has to be a 4. 4 is needed here. Missing numbers here, 1 and 3. Missing numbers down here, 8, which blocks there. So 8 goes there and 9 finishes the block. To finish this row, we will have 1, 2, and 6. I only see a 6 up there. Uh, I think we're missing 4, 8, 9 from this bottom row. I believe we are. And we've got 4 and 9 here, so that is going to be an 8. Then we can take the 8 to the top, like so, and across like this. That's going to give us an 8 there. Uh, oh, that's eight is our finished digit, our first finished digit. Everything else still to be done. Um, Uh, let's go through the digits and see if we can find anything. My Sudoku playing hasn't really been up to snuff today, I would suggest. I've certainly had better days, I reckon. Or either that or the, the, the games have been um, weirdly very difficult. It's possible, I suppose. Uh, 
Okay, five, six, seven, five, six, seven, like this. Okay, so we've got three squares containing five, six, and seven. So in the remaining squares, we're looking for two, three, four, and Oh, no, 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 I don't know, okay, no, so I've discovered something, only to have it thrown back in my face, let's go on with my um, digit search, I've got sixes, I think, Well, it looks like it's going to be pencil marks for every game today. Right, okay, let's fit the pencil marks in. Okay, um, so this is one and two over here. What else do we know about ones? Somewhere along there. This is one and three. Now, let me um, do this. Let me do this stuff up here before I forget. What did I discover? Five, six, seven up there. Five, six, seven across the top. So this is five, six, and seven. So we have twos in those squares. And we have fours in these squares. And threes can unfortunately go in any of them. I'll put that in for now. Even though it's not a pair, I'm going to put it in. And... Uh, Five, six, seven, so fives are there. And six, seven goes in any of them. I'll put it in. It's not pairs, but I'll put it in anyway. Right, okay, what's missing from here? Three and nine. And missing from here is six and seven. Ah, look. Six, seven, six, seven, six, seven. This can't be six or seven. It's got to be a five because of our uniqueness rule. Okay, that's good. So at least it hasn't made me go through the whole game looking for <laughs> something. At least I've got something quite early on rather than having to put candidates everywhere. So this is going to be a five in... Oops, wrong mode selected. This is going to be a five in that square now. Um, has it helped? Well, it's helped a tiny bit. Maybe there's a lot more to be done, I think. Um, okay, what else do we know? We know twos are in these squares here. Oops, wrong number. Twos are in those squares there. We also have two somewhere along there. And we, what's the other number across here? I've forgotten it now. One, two, and six in these squares 
We also have a pair of sixes up there. Okay, three blocking across and down here, so we get a pair of threes in those squares. Fives are done, don't be clicking on fives. Sixes are all in place, I think, of what I can do. Sevens, okay, there's a pair of three and seven up there, okay. So we know all of these three numbers, and we know this is a pair of 3 and 7, which I didn't spot, which I should have done, because look, there we go, 3 and 7, 3 and 7. See it now, see it now. So the missing numbers that go in here are 9 and 4, right? Okay, so then the 9s, that will be a 9 up here, because we've got 9 blocking up here, up here. And across like so, there is our 9 now. And we will have 4 blocking up here and up here and across here, meaning that is our 4, that is our 4, this is our 3, here's our 2. 3 here gives us a 1 in that square, 3 in that square. And then 3 across here and 3 up here makes the 3 there. One more digit for this top row, which is a 2 meaning this can not be a 2. Let's remove it. Uh, 7 blocks this square here, so that's going to be a set. Wrong mode. 7 in this square, this will be 6, and this will be 6 here, and this can be deleted. Uh, this must be a 6 down here now, and that's going to give us a 1 there and a 2 there, 2 there, 1 there. One blocking up here puts the one in that square. This will be a seven. Seven blocking down makes the seven here. Here's the three. Okay, almost done now. Six blocking down here puts the six here. There's the seven. And three blocking there puts the three there, the nine there. And we just need, well, that's going to be a two. And our missing digit here is four I want to say four blocks cross here there's our four there's our nine and nine finishes the game so uh, once the a couple of candidates are in it's a lot easier to see but no doubt the notation free crowd uh, managed that one without any small numbers I'll see you around bye bye